All right, we're getting set for the UFC's debut in Halifax this Saturday night. Joining us right now, man, who will be making his UFC debut, fighting out of Kelowna, British Columbia. He is Matt Dwyer, getting set to take on Albert Tumanov. And Matt, uh, has it set in here, fight week, getting set to make your debut on Saturday night in Nova Scotia, no less? Yeah, uh, well, it's definitely starting to set in now. Um, when I first got signed, it uh, took a little bit, but uh, I think it's starting now. <laughs> Tell us about uh, just that moment of get, finally getting the, the call that you are coming to the UFC and what that whole process was like. It, it was amazing, you know, uh, not too many people that set out to achieve a dream actually do, so uh, I, feel, I feel pretty uh, blessed right now. What, what are some of the struggles of just, you know, being one of so many fighters that are trying to get into the UFC of just, you know, getting onto Joe Silva, Sean Shelby, looking for those openings. I mean, uh, it's a very tough process to get into. I mean, was it just you just having to continue to fight and hopefully they'd notice Matt Dwyer? Yeah, exactly. The struggle was just to keep winning, man. Keep working hard every day in the gym and uh, getting those fights that'll uh, get you noticed by them, right? Taking on fights against uh, UFC vets. Um, uh, like my last fight was against Demarcus Johnson, uh, which was just a bloodbath. So yeah, I think, you know, that, that spoke for itself. Now, you were originally to fight at the UFC 176 card, the, the whole process that went down in that whole ordeal. Now you're moved to this card. What, what was that whole process like for you where you had this start date and then delayed a few months? Uh, you know, it, it is what it is. I, uh, when it got delayed, I just went back to work for a bit, uh, you know, paid, came back, paid some bills, and uh, just right back to training, man. Uh, didn't really skip a beat when it came to, to training. Uh, body's feeling great. Uh, everything's uh, feeling like it's coming together nicely. Was it the desire to have you on the Halifax card? Because you, you were linked with Alex Garcia, then Neil Magny got that fight. Was that the reason that just it made more sense to have you on the Halifax card? But yeah, yeah, it definitely made more sense to just uh, get on the Halifax card with all the Canadians on here. Uh, really, really cool, you know, seeing uh, especially Rory mm -hmm. coming from our gym, uh, fighting on the main event, you know, so two Kelowna boys uh, fighting on the same card, you know, it's, uh, it's pretty cool. Have you gotten to see Roy at all that, thus far? Oh yeah, I've seen him walking around. We've, we've been talking, so uh, yeah, no, it's it's pretty it's pretty cool. And uh, tell us a bit about just uh, preparing uh, for Albert Tumanov, who we have seen in the UFC thus far. What you have watched on him, impressions you have of Tumanov? Oh, uh, you know, he's just uh, he's a tough guy. He's a brawler. Uh, he likes to throw his punches heavy. Uh, you know, I'm gonna have a bit of a height and reach advantage on him, so I'm gonna be looking to use that to my advantage. Uh, if it goes to the ground, I'm more than comfortable to take it there. Or, you know. Uh, defend and get out of bad positions. We're, we we prepared uh, for anything really. Just be ready or anywhere. It's often said that Canada is like the largest hometown for any fighter. They just adopt everybody as their own. I'm certain that's going to be the case on Saturday for you. Uh, is that something when you're in the cage? I mean, are you aware of the crowd? Because it's, it's close to sold out on Saturday. You know it's going to be a really lively crowd. Does that ever uh, play a factor with you, just having that kind of an audience there? That's, that's going to be behind you on Saturday. Yeah, you know, I, well, I'm used to, you know, having like a hometown uh, audience cheer me on and stuff. So I, I try not to pay too much attention to that. Uh, when I'm in there, um, you know, I, just at the end of the day, once the fight gets going and uh, everything starts to become second nature, I'm not thinking anymore. That'll just that'll all be on the back burner, right? It's uh, you know, I'll have to not focus on Bruce Buffer too much either, yeah. right? <laughs> but uh, yeah, I, exactly. I'm just I, I, I'm just focusing on my job, man. I got one job to do, and that's to go out there and uh, put on a great show and win. When you when you hear people mention about octagon jitters, is that something that that you concern yourself with? It's not something you can really prepare for. Yeah, like I just. I'm just trying to look at it like it's any other fight, right? Like, mm -hmm. uh, uh, you know, I've had uh, a lot of lot of fights in my time, and then yeah, I'm just I'm just looking at it like you know he's uh, he's a tough guy that my promoter from back home that I was just fighting out of uh, called him up to fight me, right? I'll, I'll look at it like that. I just it's just like any other fight, really. That's how I'm looking at it. Once you fought Shoney Carter, you're ready for anything, right? Yeah, oh yeah, there you go, right? Show, yeah, exactly, Mr. International. So definitely that helped. For sure. Awesome. We're looking forward to it coming up Saturday night. Matt Dwyer, Albert Tumanov as DFC makes their debut at the Scotiabank Center in Halifax, Nova Scotia.